The NASCAR Monster Energy Cup Series will go to Martinsville Speedway in Virginia on Sunday, April 2nd for the STP 500. The STP 500 is the first of two races to be run at Martinsville, the shortest track in all of NASCAR. The drivers will complete 500 laps around the point, 5 to 6 mile long track with 12 degrees of banking in the corners. The track has asphalt on the short straightaways, but it is concrete in the corners and there is not much room to move around, making Martinsville a one lane track. Those starting on the outside will have a tough time getting down to the bottom lane, which is preferred, which means tempers will get flared and there will be some beating and banging going on. Because it is so short and there are 40 cars or more lining up, Martinsville is a tough place to pass, so starting position can be very important. Out of the last 13 races at Martinsville overall, counting the fall, only three winners have started outside of the top 10, although two of those winners have come in the spring race. This race in 2016 turned into the Kyle Busch show as he started out seventh, but quickly made his way through the field and led 352 laps en route to his first win of the year. He was followed across the finish line by AJ Allmendinger, Kyle Larson, Austin Dillon, and Brad Keselowski, while pole sitter Joey Logano could only manage an 11th place finish after leading 21 laps. However, no one had anything to challenge Bush, who finally got his first win at Martinsville. Richard Petty's nine wins in the Martinsville spring race stands above the rest, while Daryl Waltrip and Rusty Wallace have won five times each. Kale Yarborough, Dale Earnhardt Sr., Jeff Gordon, Jimmy Johnson, and Denny Hamlin all have three wins in this event as well. Kyle Busch is the defending champion of this race, with Denny Hamlin having won in 2015, Kurt Busch in 2014, Jimmy Johnson in 2013, and Ryan Newman in 2012. Jimmy Johnson and Denny Hamlin have dominated Martinsville for a time, and they are numbers one and two in terms of finishing average among all active drivers, as Jimmy Johnson has an average finish of 7.3 in 30 starts with nine wins overall while Hamlin is at 9.23 average finish in 22 starts with five wins overall. Denny Hamlin, who is also a Virginia native, should want to prove that he is a championship contender once again, so he should be the pick for the STP 400.